Oh, you guys have to drop a like for that. Okay, I think it's here. Yeah, week eight and uh, cool. We can unlock the camera. What's going on, guys? And welcome back to Modern Warfare 3. Final week of season four is officially here. Next week, season five starts. This week, we can finally unlock the mastery reward for doing all eight week challenges. If you've literally completed all of these weeks, you will then have the ability to unlock this camo. It's an animated camo. It goes on literally every gun. We just have to do five of these weekly challenges to unlock the camo, and I'm really excited. Also, you unlock the mutagen blueprint this week um it, it's so basic I, i'm not really excited for that listen man if you guys have done all eight week challenges leading up to this point go down below drop a like on the video i want to see who's been grinding every single week all right fellas so for the first challenge we are using a weapon without any attachments but also we need to get crouch kills it shouldn't really be too difficult because we are playing on shipment i'm just using the sapari because it's a really really good gun and you might as well use it and we're getting a lot of crouch kills let's just make sure everything is counting yeah the crouch kills are counting we also have to get like double kills without taking any damage um we honestly we should probably be able to do a lot if we could just get a bunch of kills while crouching also having no attachments on literally taking no damage as well this guy is just slide canceling oh my lord wait 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 thank you any more any more oh my god no we are literally about to do all of these challenges so fast i just unlocked a camo i guess oh there we go okay we just unlocked one of the week eight challenges i just checked i think we only did one um i'm not sure which ones we need to do There's so much chaos right now it's to keep track i think we need two more kills while crouch which is really not difficult at all okay this should be the last kill right here that should be it please give it to me give it to me give it to me and there we go nope that was not the crouching kills that was the kills with no attachment so we still need to crouch right now that's what we need to do i think we only need like three or four more kills or something thank you hold on this guy spawned literally right here hold on hold on that's another crouching kill. And there we go. All right, that's the crouching challenge. We actually need to switch up class setups to this one right here. We're using the FJX Horus, and we actually need to get triple kills with this SMG, but also at the same time, we need to get kills with a suppressed SMG. So that shouldn't be too difficult. We just need to absolutely slay out, try to get triple kills, but also just get kills with the suppressor that we have on, which we should be fine. That's a triple kill. Perfect. Oh my Lord. There's one. There's two. There's three. Let's go. Come on. Okay, there's one. Oh, there's two. Any more? Any more? Any more? Any more? I just need one more for the triple kill. Come on. I don't think that's a triple. Oh, wait. That was a triple kill. Come on. Okay, lit. Okay, I think we're good. Oh, wait. Mastery reward? Wait, I... I, okay, we did everything. That was crazy. We just did like eight challenges in a row somehow. I don't even know how. All right, well, we can actually back out. Wow, we did everything in one game. And so if we go to our weekly challenges, let's just hope that the camo works because a lot of times we complete all of these weekly challenges and they just they just don't work. All right, so week eight, it says camo collected. We also collected the new blueprint as well. Camo should be under events, I would think. Where is it? Wait, there it is. And it works. We have the hell helical reverb helical helical not sure but honestly it's a really cool camo i think it's super fitting for season four considering they just brought back the dna bomb this season and it all kind of ties in with like dna and i really like the vibes and like i said this is a universal camo so it can literally go on any weapon that you want so there you go all right guys we have the week eight camo unlocked i love how this looks i know i've been saying it a lot i've low-key been glazing oh Damn, he was upset. I've been glazing Sledgehammer, though. I'm not gonna lie. But I will say, I am just a huge fan when it comes to what Sledgehammer has been doing for just Call of Duty in general, to be honest. Sledgehammer has been adding just some of the best camos we have ever seen in Call of Duty, and they're all for free. You just have to do challenges to basically unlock them, and they can also go on any weapon you want. Also, guys, Season 5 is right around the corner. It's honestly looking really, really good. We might get the roadmap for Season 5 today. They did confirm that in season five for mw3 we are going to be getting a call of duty and wwe collab and if you guys don't know me i am huge into wwe i am an active fan i watch like raw smackdown nxt they dropped like a season five trailer today and they showcase some of the wwe content that will be coming into the game if you guys are familiar with it uh rhea ripley is getting her own skin did i just get a hit marker also a lot of the new finishing moves and like executions oh my lord a lot of the finishing moves and new 
new executions coming in season five are going to be like finishing moves and WWE moves. I think they did like the Randy Orton punt. I think they did the crossroads from Cody Rhodes. They have like an elbow drop, like a leg drop, like literally all like wrestling moves. They have them coming oh into the game. And this guy is getting so mad. It would be cool to maybe unlock like a WWE camo or, you know, some free things here and there. So I hope we definitely can. But personally, I want to see a Roman Reigns skin. I don't know about you guys. I love Roman Reigns. I love Cody Rhodes. Hopefully we see like a Cody Rhodes, Roman Reigns skin. I think that'd be pretty hype. Hold on. I'm just going to literally go in this little gondola here. Kill this man. There might be another dude. We're good. Got the advanced UAV as well. This guy's under. Wait, hold up. Got him. Beautiful. Hold up. Got him. Beautiful. Wait, we're on a 14. Maybe we can actually drop a little DNA. I don't know. We'll see. Also, according to... Oh, I'm dead. I'm dead. I'm dead. No! This guy was after me the whole game! Also, according to, like, the leaks and rumors right now with Season 5, we are going to be getting the STG-44 Assault Rifle. Obviously, we've seen that in Vanguard and just a lot of other Call of Duty games. <laughs> Good kill. He said a good kill, and I shot his body. I, now I feel bad. Why couldn't you just talk smack to me? Why'd you have to say good kill? <gasps> oh, you guys have to drop a like for that. All right, that was not the craziest trick shot in the world, but Loki, I, I hit that. I almost dropped a new. Yeah, I wasn't letting that happen. I don't know how you almost dropped the loot. I, I got on a 24. I blew you down. Yeah, I almost dropped a nuke on you, yeah, Zucana. <laughs> <laughs> so I've actually never dropped a nuke or DNA bomb on this Get Higher map. I love this map. I think it's so freaking creative, so I want to. I want to actually drop a nuke on this map. It's just so small and so chaotic. I don't even know if it's possible, but we're going to try. Hello? Wait, someone's in the middle, I'm pretty sure. Oh! Wait, are they still spawning here? <gasps> Wait! One, two, three. How many? If, if I'm going for a DNA bomb, I, I, I cannot be doing this. Wait, I just unlocked obsidian camo for this gun. I didn't even know I was close. They're behind me. Someone under me, but there's also... Got the Overwatch Hilo, perfect. I think one of them was trying to snipe me, which is a little scary, I'm not gonna lie. I almost just died. Bro, I cannot be doing this right now, man. See this guy, we got the advance, which I literally, I desperately needed this advance right now. Come on, come on, guy under here. Come on, I think there's another guy in here. Come on. Are they spawning on me? Yeah, they're spawning like literally all in here. This is not good. Oh my gosh. Come on. That guy didn't turn around. I have an overwatch shield. I got him. Oh no! I should have been dead. I have an overwatch shield. I don't think I, I can't put it up. No, I cannot put it up, dude. I guess we could just literally put up this UAV for now. I need to. Wait. I got another advance. Are you kidding? The freaking floor opened up and I still got it. Oh. Yeah. That, that might have been the coolest yeah. DNA bomb I've ever dropped. The floor opened up. I fell down and I still was able to get the DNA. I cannot believe that. All right, also guys, I just wanted to quickly go over the season five trailer. Uh, I cannot play the music because I'm pretty sure it's copyright, but we're having a look at everything coming within this season. Some of the new skins, uh, we have some returning characters, but Superstore is returning in Warzone from Verdansk, which honestly, I think is a huge W. I think this is honestly a hint though that Verdansk is coming back. You just saw that dude actually do a power bomb finisher kind of like a batista bomb from wwe we have a new multiplayer map called bait that's the crossroads right there from cody Rhodes and wwe 
We have a new throwable spear as well. And then there's Rhea Ripley as well. So this is like the only confirmed WWE skin we have right now. I really hope there's more because there's so many good wrestlers and like WWE superstars we can get. But we also have this new map called Yard as well. Tunox side, which is a map variant, also shipment variant. So I think that's a rust and shipment cell shaded variant maps, which is kind of cool. Another like Rey Mysterio type uh, character, another crossroads right there. Like, I hope we can actually fight in that WWE ring, but season five starting July 24th. Anyway, guys, that's enough MW3 for me today. Let me know down below in the comments what you think about this brand new camo. I honestly think it's really cool. Thank you all so much for watching. I'll see you guys next time.